Okay, so this is probably going to be the quickest Q&A video ever done, and I know right now you're staring at a black screen. That is on purpose because it is how you're feeling. Down, angry, depressed, and really frustrated. So I'm going to try to relieve you of all of that anguish by telling you how to delete a protected EFI disk partition in Windows 7, 8, or 10. So with no further ado, let's get right to it. Launch computer management. I know you've already been in here, but I wanna go back in here to show you the actual issue. So you're trying to probably delete these partitions, right? You can't do it in here. Right click over it. No, no, there is no way to do this in here, unfortunately. You want maybe all on allocated space, like this drive above it, right? So how do you do it? Easy, you call a friend, and that friend's called disk part. Once in here, type in list disk. It will list the disks. Then select the disk you want to clean. So select disk, in my case it's zero. Type in list disk. Again, to confirm that it is selected, there will be an asterisk by it. And then type in clean. And after that, it will ask you to initialize the disk so you can set it up, partition, and format it as you like. Hope you liked this video. If you did, thumb it up. Also, subscribe to the channel. I'm Rodney Reynolds from 3dgameman.com and Toodaloo.